Hi, everyone. I'm Dr. Natalie Baumgartner. I'm the Chief Workforce Scientist at Achievers. And today I want to talk with you about the Achievers Critical Event Survey and Toolkit that we developed in response to the COVID-19 pandemic. I want to start by sharing a little bit about why we put it together, what it entails, and how it works. I'll finish by explaining how you can use the survey and toolkit today to support the well-being of your employees and thus your organization as you respond to the pandemic. When a critical event occurs, whether it's a pandemic, a traumatic event, or a natural disaster, organizations need to be empowered to support their people. That empowerment was our mission as we, the Achievers Workforce Institute team, dove deep to identify the most robust academic research and business practices informing this topic. Now we want to empower you as managers and leaders to help your teams through this challenging time. So what does empowerment look like? Well, in this case, empowerment is about investing in protective drivers that can improve resilience and coping strategies during and after a critical event. At the Workforce Institute, we've identified six protective drivers that predict employee resilience and organizational continuity. These drivers comprise the core of our eight question critical event survey. The first protective driver is information sharing. Evidence shows employees that receive timely and credible information are more quickly able to cope with change. Even if the news is challenging or you don't have all the answers, sharing truth is incredibly important. Next is support. Do your employees have the resources they need to be successful in their roles during this time? Having the tools, technology, and plans necessary to move this unprecedented event is a major predictor of long-term success. Moving on to balance. It goes without saying that work-life balance is severely impacted in times of crisis. Although some of the realities related to balance can't be changed, it's still important that you're checking in to see how employees feel about their ability to balance work and professional obligations and how you might help more. Next, well-being. There's a strong correlation between stress and crisis, which can lead to physical and mental health challenges. If well-being is compromised, everything else comes to a standstill. Be sure to keep tabs on how you can support this fundamental protective factor. And finally, contact, which is split into two types. If you were to focus on one factor alone, this would be it. There is nothing more important in times of crisis than maintaining contact. And that's made even more difficult by the social isolation that's in effect. The first type of contact to address is that with leaders and managers, a crucial tool in times of challenge. The second type of contact is that with peers and colleagues. Evidence shows that maintaining relationships with coworkers decreases burnout and increases motivation. What's more, if contact exists, then all of the other protracted drivers we've talked about become easier to address. If you're measuring and acting on all of these key drivers, your organization is more likely to come through this critical event not just intact, but with a strong and well-adjusted workforce. All of the critical agent protective drivers I just reviewed are measured in our simple eight-question survey, which you can administer either through the Achievers platform or through any survey solution of your choice. I recommend surveying your employees every few weeks during this critical period of time to baseline and track potential issue areas. Our critical events toolkit can then be used to empower managers to use very simple tactics to start to act on crisis hotspots today. The toolkit offers simple conversation starters to connect with employees and dig into their specific needs. No training required. During a critical event, how we respond will determine how successful we'll be at navigating troubled waters. I hope these tools and resources will help you connect with your employees and empower your leaders, allowing you to move through these challenging times with a strong and resilient workforce. From everyone at Achievers and the Workforce Institute, thank you, and we wish you well.